The morning turned out to be unusually soothing. A gentle breeze found its way through half-open windows, driving away musty air from the apartment. Well, that's good. Hello, everyone. We are back with Twilight Town, a cyberpunk day in life. Sophia's ringing voice could be heard from the other side of the window, too. It announced the beginning of the weekend. Oh my gosh, that sounds so annoying, but whatever. I stretched out and went to turn the kettle on. Say hummed to herself cheerfully with not a care in the world. What's she humming, hmm? You're up early today! <laughs> it's Saturday. I can't waste time. I need to build you up from the ground up, say. Are you going to gamble again? Oh my gosh, she sounds like... <laughs> yeah. You should stop this, Ikuro. You understand it won't end well, don't you? Oh, say knows what's up, dude! Gosh, gosh, here we go again. Nag, nag, nag. Blah, blah, blah. Say at a point, though, but I'm only doing this for her sake. But, Ikuro, if she was really your girlfriend, she wouldn't want you to sacrifice so much for her. Once I have enough money to buy enough memory modules for my lifetime, I'll stop gambling, I swear. I mean, I understand that because, like, the only way for him to get money is to get is to gamble, but hopefully he can get out of the gambling prediction. At least that's what I tell myself anyway. Okay, so that's actually a problem. You know you need a new memory module. You're right, but... No talking back, Say. I poured myself some tea and sat down on the sofa. Maybe Say is right. Maybe I really should find a source of income that was steady and legal. Why can't you just do both? Why can't you just find a source of income and then go gamble? Then you'll have like double the amount of income. But then I'll have to cast my dream aside. No way. What dream? Isn't your dream not to have like a AI girlfriend? <laughs> I chose- I choose- no, I chose. I chose to walk this shady path despite what my teachers, my own mother, and Sophia too keep telling me. The only thing I'm really good at is not paying attention to the lessons I'm given. This makes me proud deep down, even though it's not something you brag about. It's a good enough coping mechanism. I mean, I suppose it's like you have your little, like, rebellious life. Ooh, look at me! I'm living life off the grid of people! Like... <laughs> I'm worried about you, Ikuro. I don't want to lose all your money. Why don't you listen to me? No. No, it's me who's worried. Besides, I haven't lost a single time this week, and I'm not going to lose today either. Bro, you don't know that. Come on. Say didn't answer. I don't know why I lied. She probably knows about my fiasco yesterday, but I just couldn't bring myself to say it out loud. Perhaps I don't want to disappoint her, or what's even worse, I let her fear feel insecure. I put my shoes on, threw my jacket over my shoulder, and stepped outside. Uh, I mean... I feel like at the end of this point, can't we just find something legal to get our money's worth? I left the elevator and was about to leave when the building- uh, leave the building when something unusual caught my attention. maya son was absent, but the door to her room was open. Ooh! I don't think I've ever seen this happen before. Time to sneak in and steal her stuff, right? I glanced around to make sure there wasn't a soul in the hall and- uh, hall and stuck my head inside. Well, what is that? Well, uh, let's see. Nightfall Prime. A flagrant violation of law. It happened this morning in the block of 24th residential sector. Hey, yo. According to the witness's statement, some unknown individuals committed multiple acts of violence against a woman. Holy shit. Can't you spin the goddamn tape fast? Okay, so it's definitely not a robot. Ahem. Um, oh, whatever, I'll keep going. Um, get a load of this. Not only that lady didn't resist, and she she even seemed to like e. We certainly have seen and know about and maybe even tried certain things. But that's not all, my darlings. Eyewitnesses claim that the beating was going on for at least five minutes. Bro, wait, wait, you're reporting on a woman getting beat up, dude? Then boom, a bright flash followed and all the culprits were suddenly on the ground. Everything was covered in blood, intestines, and other lovely things. And what do you think happened next? Our heroine marched through the exit like nothing ever happened. Is this like a new show? I felt shivers running up my back. That's not all. According to the investigators' reports, that's important. A synthetic eye was discovered at the crime scene. Suddenly I felt someone's heavy hand crash down on my so shoulder. <gasps> Is it Nobu? Is it Maya-san? Startled, I shrieked, shrieked and turned around. My son. She was right in front of me with some mischievous smile on her face. I gave her the most disgruntled stare possible. Hey, easy now. It wasn't on purpose. Who wouldn't know you're such a scaredy cat? By the way, what are you sniffing around? Uh, well, uh, what are you sniffing out here? Well, I just heard the news and got interested. Get lost, kid. She was obviously upset that I stuck my nose in her private space. 
She shouldered me aside, entered the room, and shut the door. That woman. She's a simly? Smiley? Sim illy. Smil. It's like smile without the e. Smile. Uh, smilly. Smilly. Right? That's why they're beating her up. I didn't mean to address the words to her, but Maya son still replied. Don't. Don't make it your burden. It was sure easy to say. That's strange. Why would a simly smiley end up in a place like, uh, end up such a place the, in the circumstances? Something is off. What is a simile you ask? Yeah, please tell me, Kuro, because I, I don't know. I feel like I'm butchering this. You can say it's a perfected version of AI, locked up in a fancy shell. Each of them have an AST module installed in its head, similar to Say's, but much lighter. There are tens of thousands of sim similes, similes in the city, and the modules are priceless, and they use them for these. I don't even know what to call them. Mannequins probably the most suitable world. Similes, however, are absurdly expensive, though the government will give them out as hand-me-downs such as my son here if you run a large enough business or entity like a hotel or apartment complex. Oh wait, my son's a simly? Smiley? Sim- Simmy? Simly? Oh man, okay. That's, that, that makes sense. As far as I could tell, people always felt superior to simleys and treated them with disdain. Oh man, we're getting Detroit become human problems here, huh? Like, for the most part, I disagreed with that attitude. The very thing that separates humans from AI is, well, intelligence. If an AI is just as smart and capable as a human, it should be considered a human. Certain kinds of people will just say no matter how complex they may be, they're merely lines of code simply acting the way- acting that way and don't actually have emotions. But I digress. Well, yeah, you're literally the one building, like, the AI girlfriend, right? So... Hey! Don't you have stuff to do? My thinking was disturbed by Maya son's formidable voice. I'm going to work and I would very much like it if you didn't get in the way. She put huge emphasis on the words very much. Wait, are you really gonna leave it at that? Yes, Ikuro. Oof. All right, let's go gamble. <laughs> I'd love to see what that looks like. I was going to the gambling sector in a half empty monorail. An image appeared deep inside my mind, a corridor soaked in blood, dismembered bodies. So do simplies have like intestines? Like, so if they're just AI robots, but do they have flesh on the inside? It did say on the newscast that like, there was like blood and flesh and the simile seemed to like it, but like, if they do need that, then technically this, where do they have to get that kind of thing? And the day seems so soothing in the morning, but this is why I try to avoid listening to the news. Another image appeared, now it was Say, looking at me with a mix of disappointment and sadness on her face. I'm doing this for you, Say. But again, ah, once I have enough memory modules for you, I'll stop gambling, I promise. The mood got worse every second. The confidence I felt this morning was completely gone too. You think Say would be happy though, knowing that like you spent all like all the counterfeit money you're spending is just on her parts? Like I don't think she'd be happy to know that like you got like bad money to spend on her parts and shit. What am I even hoping for? I lost 20 grand like yesterday. Now I only had two. Not to mention the, the these were my last money. The chances for success were slim. Well, my question is, like, do you have an obtainable goal? Like, I know you and your friend- was it Hang? It was like H-E-N-G, right? Hang? Like, you guys, like, interchange of, uh, giving out modules to each other, but, like, are you- like, unless I see, like, oh, you're going to, like, oh, something that's really expensive, like, I can't really condone gambling. I mean, technically, I guess you shouldn't condone gambling in general, but I feel like you shouldn't just gamble just to gamble. Some puddles began jumping around the monorail car, which meant I was almost there. Ooh, are we gonna go to the gambling sector? In a minute, I was in the doors trying to gather enough courage to step outside. Stand clear of the closing doors, please. Shit, to hell with this, I'm going back home. Why? Wait, didn't you commit- Oh my god, okay. Half an hour later, I stood at the spacious area in front of my residential block. Nobu's mug appeared on my cell phone screen. My finger was shaking right above the call button. Are you gonna ask him for money? Oh my god, didn't I give him, like, the Kel voice that I had before? Like, hey, like, hey, what's up? I, I totally forgot, jeez. Listen, can you lend me some money? Money? Why? Just do it, bruh! That's <laughs> why you negotiate an argument, come on. How do I know you'll pay back? It's the first time I've ever asked you for anything, man. Mar- Mari! Mari! <laughs> oh my god, Mari, I swear! Oh my god, okay. <laughs> Mari and I were about to go and have some fun, but I guess I'll swing by your place. Mari, oh my god. <laughs> Treat us to something nice and we'll see. Ha ha ha. Fine, come over. Now that's better. We'll be there in an hour. Actually, I... He hanged up. Ooh, make sure he doesn't fuck up with Say. I found Maya san sitting at her tiny desk, as usual, swinging out some papers. Though she began nervously putting them away as soon as she noticed me. 
Hey kid, what are you doing here? Don't you have anything to do? Um, as far as I know, I live here. I thought I could come home whenever I want. I see you like to joke around. I have my hands full, so go mind your own business. She's- oh, she, she's in some- she's busy right now, huh? Maya san was still nervously fidgeting her in her chair, hiding her papers. She gave me a glare, it was so menacing and it was clear I wasn't welcome to her. Sorry. I hung my head to avoid looking at her desk. Maya's strict expression softened lightly. Slightly. Do you need something or just came to say hi? Um, I- do you, do you still have, well, the, the bottle? Her eyes sparkled. So the boy made up his mind when he wants to become a man now. I'll help you with this re <laughs> this rest assured. I hope she didn't get me wrong. Wait a second. After digging through the drawer for a while, she pu uh, she pulled out a familiar familiar plastic bag and approached me, looking pleased. Here. She handed me the bag with a pompous look on her face. You're not even gonna ask what I need it for? Oh, <laughs> literally, no, no, that's not even his voice. I'm literally going back to to wrong speak. As if I don't already know. Ha ha ha. Okay. I carefully took the bag and immediately hid it inside my backpack. Thank you. <sighs> now get out of here already. Okay, well, I guess thanks, Maya-san. Yes, ma'am. On my way out, Maya-san smacked my butt. Okay. I didn't know how to react, so I nervously giggled and walked towards the elevator. On my way out, I heard a familiar but faint laugh. <laughs> okay, sure. This means war now.